So since Microsoft bought Beam, a streaming platform just like Twitch or YouTube Gaming or many others out there, uh, they renamed it to Mixer and well, on Windows mobile devices or even on Windows desktops, you don't have an app to use it. So the only way to use it is through browser and as you can see, it just takes so much time to load something. The, the experience is definitely not good on the browser. Let's click on something to see if it will even open, but uh, I'm pretty sure it will not even open. But yeah, as you see, the experience is pretty damn bad. And well, as expected from Microsoft, Microsoft has already an app for iOS devices for Android, but not for Windows. Well, surprise, surprise. But a third party application has come up to the store, which is Mixer Plus. And surprisingly, the app works pretty damn good. The, the app is ba basic, of course, uh, but you can still log in with your account. I don't even remember my account on Mixer, so I can't really log in with it. But let's click on the same um, on the same stream that we tried to click before and voila voila, it opens. Uh, it says at the bottom you need to log in in order to use the chat, but you can see the chat even if you don't log in. Let's go for example in this uh, streamer. Let's see if someone will be in the chat. And yeah, someone is in the chat and it works without any problems. And to go full screen, you just press this uh, arrow and it goes full screen without any problem. It works as it should. So Microsoft, shame on you. This should have been an app that you made. It's definitely better than the browser itself. But hey, Microsoft, this is your own platform. Like, okay, let's not talk about Windows Mobile. Let's talk about Windows desktops. You don't even have an app on the store on Windows desktops. Coming from Microsoft, it's not a surprise. But here is the app for Android and here is a third party app for Windows Mobile. Uh, as you can see, the design is a bit uh, kind of close, like the background and stuff. But of course, the official app has much more uh, options, has uh, scroll from the right, has settings, of course, as well. Uh, even though the settings, well, they're not anything special, but yeah. This is the app guys, um, it's unfortunate that Microsoft doesn't even care about their own customers, but yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one.